Hello everyone, it's Peter here again from Renew Me. Thank you so much for coming by, thank you so much for subscribing, and thank you so much for being a part of my channel. As always, I thank everybody for being so positive and so wonderful, and thank you for your wonderful questions. And as I always say, they're always very intelligent questions, and they're questions that, you know, need to be asked. So if you do have a question, please ask it, because it might be somebody else is thinking the same thing but doesn't want to ask it. And then hopefully what will happen is if you ask the question, I'll be able to answer it and everyone can benefit and that's the wonderful thing about all the comments that you make below is that people do read them I can give some wonderful instruction within those comments as well that will be helpful so please do feel free to make comments and thank you for the ones that you're making all right today guys I'm going to be doing an exercise on the eye bags now this is a really good exercise to help squeeze away all the lymph and all the toxins that's sitting under your eye now the thing is, is that with our face it's not symmetrical. So it might be that you might be experiencing in one eye puffiness and the other eye doesn't look puffy. It certainly happens to me and I know it happens to a lot of people I speak to. This side of my face is puffs up. So if I haven't you know, had enough water at night or it might have had too much alcohol the night before, um, this eye tends to puff up. So when you're doing this exercise what I'd like you to do is if you experience that problem, I want you to be very mindful about what you're doing. And again, it goes back to the five principles of the face aerobics program, which is isolate the muscle, visualize the muscle, activate the mind-body connection, repetitions, and hold and freeze for the lactic burn. Now why I say it comes back to the five principles is because when you're activating the mind-body connection and when you're visualizing the muscle, I want you to put more of your focus on the side that it puffs up more. Now I know there's a lot of stuff going on, you, you know, you have to be aware of your hand placements and you have to be aware of, you know, scrunching the eyes, doing the exercise with your hands. I know there's a lot of stuff happening, but if you, if you can practice doing this, if you find that one side is dropping or the other side, whatever is happening on your face, if you can split your focus between what you're doing, then you can make this side work a bit harder or the other side work a bit harder, depending on what side is drooping. So with the eye bag eliminator exercise, what we're going to do is this. We're going to put our mouth into an O shape. Now, as you put your mouth into an O shape, what I want you to do is to make this very um, taut. And you'll need to look in the mirror when you're doing it because if you put it into a shape like this, you're going to create more wrinkles doing this exercise. Okay, so the way you do this is you make an O shape and then you stretch out the corners of your mouth trying to smile. So have a look in the mirror, see if you're doing it right. So it might be you have a mirror in front of you while you're watching the video or if you need to come back to the video, come back to the video and see if you're doing it right. So let's do it again. It's really important that I'm getting this right for you because I don't want you to create more wrinkles around your mouth. So then we do the eye shape, then we place our fingers just on our cheekbone, on the top of our cheekbone. Okay, now you place them firmly but not so firmly that the muscles don't move. Now notice my fingers are not in the corners of my eyes. Notice they're just down along the cheekbone. It's along the cheekbone area here. Okay, so we're doing... So that's the second part of the exercise. Then I want you to look up, but I don't want you to look so far up that you're wrinkling again. I just want you to look up as far that your forehead isn't wrinkling. And then as you look up, you gently squeeze. So what you should be doing is using this muscle, the orbicularis oculi, and you should be squeezing it gently. Okay? And when you do the squeeze, just try to squint. All right? Just squint your eyes without having to move anything else. Now, as you're doing that, what's happening is that all of this is pumping out, all of the lymph, lymph that's in there, all the toxins, is pumping 
out of this area here because there's all these little lymph nodes and drainage areas where it all starts to drain out. Sometimes you might feel under here, you might feel at you know, the back of your throat some um, phlegm happening and that's what's happening now. So let's do it again. Okay, so this exercise is not an eye exercise for this area. It's an exercise for this area here. So this is where you should be placing all your concentration is in this area. And although these muscles are moving because you can't do the exercise without those muscles moving, this is the area that you're concentrating on. Now, what might happen is it might look a little bit puffy for a second. So when you finish, just run your fingers very gently very gently along your eyes and that just helps move along the lymph a little bit more okay so that's the exercise I really hope it helps you today I really hope that you get some success from it if you've got excessive fluid you just do that exercise each day and really concentrate on seeing all that fluid running away and draining away and then make sure that you do the little rub afterwards, the little drainage rub afterwards. It's actually quite nice. Okay guys, well I hope that's helped you today. Please let me know in the comments below and please do have a look at my pictures at the end because it really will show you the differences that I've made on my face by doing facial exercises and if you haven't seen them before you really will be amazed at them. Alright guys, you have a lovely day wherever you are in the world and I'll see you next time. Bye!